Final Fantasy VII Double High Wind Breakdown Glitch This will only work with PlayStation ver CD version of Final Fantasy VII, no other version. First thing you need to do is put, capture a chalkboard and put it near the desert in Gun Saucer. Now you need to head Tiny Bronco to Wu Tai. Now what you want to do is initiate the fight with Yuffie. Now what will happen when you exit the screen is that it will warp you back to Gun Saucer area and back on that chocobo. Now what I'm going to do is a MacGyver trick, I have to do emergency speedrun of this to show what happened. It. I'm going to change this now to Populous the beginning and I'm going to bypass going through North Coral. It's a lot faster than... Then going all the way around all the random battles now. Now as you can see the world map has glitched. Now you need to change this back to Final Fantasy VII and get into a random fight. Now watch what happened, because I did the emergency bypass, I had to bypass Juno and it would trigger this event with Rufus. Because I bypass Juno and not going the proper way around, it triggers this event by going backwards. The respawn point is by the steps to trigger this event. Let's fast forward this a bit. Now you want to talk to the guy here, give him 10 gil, under gil, and you head back to Junon. I'm going to flash it on until we get to the Zolem. Because what I got to do now is do something that Def Unitas for Fortnite production never even thought of doing the Zolam skip backwards because we lost Little Bronco we can't do this normally the game was soft lock here on this continent now to do the Zolam skip backwards Notice that I did not go to calm I bypassed this because I had to do much the Gaiver kamikaze job on this to get it running on the PlayStation to test it. Because I discovered it with PlayStation 4. Now with Zola, you need to bait it here. As soon as the tail goes, go across. Stop here. Continue. Now I recommend that you save now because I'm going to do the disk swap trick again. First thing you need to do is catch Chocobo. Notice that Tiny Blanco is at Rutai. Normally the game will be soft locked at this point. What I'm doing is a little bit of MacGyver trickery 
by using an exploit of the disk swap glitch. Now, NTSC PlayStation owners, you need Saga Frontier on a CD version of Final Fantasy VII to do this. NTSC place uh, Power PlayStation owners, you need Publish the Beginning CD version and a copy of Final Fantasy VII. Doesn't matter if it's English, German, or French, it will both do the same trick. Now you need to change discs to the other game. Now, give it a few seconds. Then you need to head to Midgar. And we're heading now for Icicle Area. You will notice that the map is totally random. You can go anywhere where there's a green tile with a chocobo. The only places it will not go through is water and desert. This is an art in itself. Now you need to be careful of mountains and all that when you get off. Now you need to change this back to Final Fantasy VII. Don't worry, I put a tutorial video in the description. The original PAL version I made and the original one for the NTSC version. You need to get into a random fight. Notice that Tiny Bongo is at Wu Tai flashing. This is to undo the soft lock. Now as you can see, Icicle Area is back to normal. I'm going to save it you and I'm going to flash it on to the high wind. Now I flashed it onto the high wind. Now what I discovered by doing the skip with the Yofi side quest while it's still on, when you land the high wind, it will not allow you to give it, get back onto it. Just the same as the little tiny bronco. Now watch the dialogue with Tifa. Notice it can't get back on. Now to undo the soft lock here, we gotta get rid of Tifa and put Sid in. Because now we will have regained access control of the high wind. This is something I didn't think would happen, but unfortunately. The game will not allow you to do a double Yofi before the Diamond Weapon and the beginning of Desk 3. It will not allow you. It only triggers with Diamond Weapon and the start of this 3. For some reason it puts you Yuffie back into the game. 
we got control of the highway. Notice the dialogue we've said now. Now you can do the side quest with Sid, Tifa and Cloud on this two with the highway. Now we're going to do exactly the same with Tifa. That the highway will still, even if I go to Wu Tai Island, it will still lock up. Now the dialogue is slightly different with Yofi. Turks. Now I'm going to show you that you cannot get your fee back in with a double your fee glitch, unfortunately. Now for the bonus glitches. Now for the bonus glitch with Material Keeper, being as I did emergency bypass. We got Sid as a leader, not Cloud. Now we're going to take on the Materia Keeper with Yuffie and Eric. Now if you'll notice that if I can get back out there's got to be a way of somehow doing like a guard skip here. Think of this one uh, if you like this. To all those gamers out there, the truth is in gameplay. I am the doctor. Thank you for watching.